Once there lived a young boy in a small town who exhibited extreme laziness and a persistent habit of procrastination. He consistently delayed urgent tasks, succumbing to procrastination, which resulted in him lagging behind in his studies and various aspects of life compared to his peers. Despite numerous admonitions from his family and teachers to value his time, he remained indifferent to their advice, showing little concern for his future and squandering his time on trivial matters. One day, a renowned and wise monk visited their town, attracting many who sought his wisdom and enlightenment. The young boy, too, decided to visit the monk, hoping to gain insights that would help him excel in life. Upon his turn, he bowed to the monk and implored, O oh, revered one, please assist me. I feel like a failure in my life, falling behind my friends and classmates in every aspect. I aspire to surpass them and become the best. Kindly guide me on how to achieve this. The monk, filled with compassion, responded, My child, you are suffering because you do not value your time. You procrastinate and waste precious moments that can never be reclaimed. Allow me to share a story that will elucidate the value of time. The boy listened attentively as the monk narrated, Once upon a time there was a king known for his generosity and kindness. He loved his people and always supported them. One day he encountered an old classmate who was lazy and impoverished. This classmate constantly complained about his misfortune and blamed others for his plight. The king, feeling sympathy, inquired about his troubles. The classmate lamented, O oh king, I do not understand why people say I am incapable. Even when I seek employment, I am rejected. My enemies claim that I never complete tasks on time. I am at a loss. The king proposed a deal. Before sunset, come to my treasury and collect as much gold and gems as you can. It will all be yours. The classmate, overjoyed, thanked the king and hurried home to share the news with his wife. She urged him to seize the opportunity immediately, but he insisted on eating lunch first. After a leisurely meal, he felt drowsy and decided to take a nap, sleeping for two hours. When he awoke, it was late afternoon. On his way to the treasury, he felt hot and rested under a tree, falling asleep for another four hours. By the time he reached the palace, the sun had set and the gates were closed. He had missed his chance to acquire wealth because he failed to value his time, the monk concluded the story, and the boy, struck by its message, realized his mistake. He thanked the monk and resolved to change his ways, understanding that time is precious and should not be wasted. He returned home, dedicated himself to his goals, stopped procrastinating and became more productive and successful. He also gained respect and happiness from his friends and family. In life, time is akin to gold. It is our most valuable asset. We must use it wisely and productively, avoiding waste on inconsequential matters. As the saying goes, if you value your time, time will value you. But if you squander your time, it will ruin your life. By valuing our time, we can achieve great things, but if we waste it, we will lose opportunities and face regret. The value of a minute can be learned from a traveler who missed a train by a minute, and the value of a year from a student who failed his exams. Those who respect their time can achieve anything, while those who do not are destined for failure. To succeed in life, avoid laziness and procrastination. Use your time wisely, cherish moments with loved ones, and you will achieve your goals and live a fulfilling life.